Yeah. 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 You're trying to get a cookie on the feet. Oh, look at Duck. Look at Amy. Say thank you, Miss Amy, for rescuing me. I've never seen a face like this. I don't think I've ever seen a face like this. Is she not delicious? Oh my God, I can't get enough. I see you cuddling, Daddy. I see all the photos of you all over Facebook. I laugh every time. You should see it when he comes home. Because, like, he, he's home most of the day, but then he goes to the gym and I come home. And then he comes home later. It's like... She's attached. It's like a movie star has come home. She's in love with him. Mm -hmm. You have the magic touch. Oh, he's the dog whisperer. You oh, told me sure. that from day one. Yeah, he is. Because he's very chill and whatever. And... Hi, Zoe. Yes, it is. It's Betty Boop, Betty Bunny Boop, baby girl. She, Zoe actually took... Zoe's on here. She's a volunteer of ours. Oh. Awesome, awesome. She's just amazing. Nice. She took Betty Boop home with Bandit to kind of see what their personalities were and update me. And she said, Thank clearly, so Betty Boop does not need to stay with Bandit. He, she's independent. She loves cats. She loves dogs. She loves everybody. Bandit is just an attention hog. He needed to be with a person or any dog for that matter. Um, hey, everybody. Happy Wednesday. Wow, we're on a roll today, huh? From early this morning, I dropped Mo, a.k.a. Moped, Moped off at his new mommy in Pembroke Pines. From there, I ran to Coral Springs, and we did the adoption for Teddy. Uh, and now we're here at VCA Imperial Point Animal Hospital with our sweet little angel, Betty Bunny Boop now, right? Is that how you're saying her name? Mm -hmm. Betty Bunny Boop. <laughs> Tell everybody your name. Whitney. James. Guys, this, this couple, when I tell you the email that was sent to me from Whitney, I cannot even put into words. I was like, oh my God, if I could only clone her times a zillion. Perfection, perfection, perfection. And when I mean perfection, I mean true, true animal, unconditional parents. Um, her husband, James, is definitely a dog whisperer over here. We love him. <laughs> And he's home all pretty much all day with the babies. They have a beautiful pack, a beautiful family. They have cats, they have dogs, and little Betty Boop over here. If you remember Betty Boop when she was brought into our organization, she came in with Bandit. And every picture was with Bandit on her head or she on top of Bandit. And everybody's like, you can't separate them, you can't. And come to find out, they were not bonded at all. She tolerated him, um, and he just needed somebody. She just needs a lap, and she loves, she loves their cat. What's your cat's name again? Neo. Neo. The, the photos are just priceless. I follow Whitney and James on Facebook. They have her all over the place with their babies, and I love the tags. We became Facebook friends, um, Whitney and myself. So I see all the beautiful photos that are posted daily. So um, little Betty Bunny Boop, who was Betty Boop, now Betty Bunny Boop, uh, <laughs> she came into us hotworm positive and uh, some eye issues. So I made the appointment today for uh, James to take our little baby girl to Dr. Carastro in Deerfield. And we got some great report. No surgery needed, uh, just proper eye medications and she should improve, which is fantastic. She doesn't need anything else. Um, with her being hotworm positive, we decided... Um, strongly, I decided that I do not want to put her through the aw awful, painful, hard imidacide injections in her little frail body. So we're going to go the slow method, and we're going to do the heart guard. I ordered um, Whitney the boxes. I think there were like 24. I don't even remember. But two, we're going to do two of them a month, and then we'll recheck her in about six months and see where we go from there. On top of that, she is not spayed, and an animal cannot safely, that's recommended not to be put under anesthesia and surgery while a dog is hotworm positive. So Whitney is just, and James are just two beautiful <laughs> souls to take all this on. Me personally, this is my kind of dog. It truly is. I mean, look at, this is ridiculous. Yeah. I mean, I don't even know if she's in the, can you guys see her? <laughs> Say hi. Say hi. Have you ever seen a face like this ever? No. Nothing. Just sweet name. Do you have anything you want to say, Whitney? Oh, we're just um, feel very privileged and grateful to be selected as her people. That we um, we take this very seriously, and this is for life. And so we're just really honored to be her guardians, and uh, we will love and adore her for all of her life. So we love we you, and we so, so appreciate much. you both, James and Whitney. 
so much. And I'm going to continue following you. So guys, we're here at VCA and Perry Point. The reason for this video, as you know, I know, I know, I'm going in, I'm going in for the eye kisses, don't worry. Um, we're doing the official adoption, so we're transferring all the microchip information and um, ownership over and signing her up for True Panion for 30 days. And our baby girl is forever home, and she could not have hit a more amazing jackpot. There's no, this is better than winning the lottery, to me anyway. Mommy, can I give kisses? Yes. There's a lot of people that are on here saying, I'm so sorry, I wanted to be there, but they're stuck at work or they're doing something else. And that's so you never, ever, ever see anything bad ever again in your entire life. And you're looking mm -hmm. at Daddy, aren't you, yeah. when I say that? Because mm -hmm. you know it. Mm -hmm. Happy life. We love you so much, Betty Bunny Boop. Thank 100 you plus my life. abandoned dogs of Everglades, Florida. Another life saved, our baby girl is home.